What's up guys and welcome back to another Real Madrid preview game. I'm sure that all Real Madrid and Atletico Madrid fans are shaking right now because this game literally and it literally decides the winner. This is the biggest game of the season. And I shake that with Chelsea, I've said that with Sevilla. And if had, had we beaten Sevilla, we wouldn't even be in this position. Had we beaten Sevilla, we would be on the same point as Atleti and we wouldn't be two points behind them like we are and we wouldn't have to rely on them losing for us to win the title um, because this game is a must win and must hope Atletico Madrid lose I'll be staying up until the game starts at 12 a.m. for me um, it'll be 12 a.m. for me and 5 p.m. UK time then when I watch the game I'll be bringing you guys 6 p.m. content on my main channel link in the description of course and then obviously all that i'll be chilling you know it's saturday just have a chill um i might i think i might start with the four or five and then go to bed around then um uh, play some fifa as well but it's all popping off and uh, because this is arguably the biggest day of the season we did horribly in you know the domestic cups and all that and then we have the champions league and the liga Champions League got talked by Chelsea, um, and then we are left with La Liga basically um, to try to win. Obviously, this game is before the Sunday video of Real Madrid news. We will probably talk about this and a whole more. I think the Real Madrid news video on Sunday is gonna be very long, uh, so obviously do stay tuned for that. Uh, without further ado, though, we are gonna put in the manager Zidane, and this is obviously the biggest game. So we need the biggest team, the best players. So Courtois and Go, there's no need to argue with that. There's no need to even talk about Lewin at this at this point. Left back, well, mainly I think he needs to get a bit more game time. Um, and this is a weird one, cause would we play Gutierrez in the game that we need to win, or would we go with Marcelo? I'm backing on Zidane to pick the right choice and go Marcelo because he has the experience. Um, if he does take the US, then I'm going to be very shocked because we're relying on 16, 17 year olds. Um, and then I'm taking a bit of Odrio Zola at right back. As the same thing, I don't see Marvin play. So if Carvajal is injured, Vasquez is not playing, we are left with Odrio Zola or we are going to play Nacho or Minitao there, which is stupid. Center back wise, um, Zidane has said that Ramos is fit. Um, so Ramos is going to play, right? If there's a game for him to play, this is literally the game for him to play. You can play, you can, you cannot play for every single game, apart from the La Liga title decider. Maybe he has to play against the Madrid derby and he has to play against Barca for the El Clasico. However, there's other games, there's the entire games in the league, apart from Atletico and Barca that he can don't play. But he has to play this, um, because he can either be laughing and smiling or in tears of joy because we have won and Atletico Madrid lost if that's a miracle or he'll be crying that of not joy but crying of pain because we lost the title even though we won but Atletico Madrid drew or won and they got the title um, um, which is pretty horrifying as a fan um, then I think as my center back I think we can, we, we can either go with the Spanish link, how we have seen that less often. So I'm backing him to play Militao. I just have that feeling that Militao is going to play. Um, honestly, I have that feeling Militao and Ramos. Even though it didn't quite work, it didn't work that well against Chelsea. Um, I feel like these are going to be my back five. Um, I know I'll definitely get three or four of them. Maybe not three, maybe not four, but I think I'll get at least three of them correct. Um, just Ancho, maybe Marcelo and maybe Militao. I think Odrizola, Ramos and Cosa are pretty much set. Um, then we're going to make you. Um, I've always said that we are going to play Valverde. Um, but I'm backing Zidane to pick the right choice. Um, I'm backing Tony Cruz, um, Modric, and I'm backing Casemiro. <coughs> That this is going to be our three midfielders. Um, we have to go with the strongest team. Um, left wing. 
Um, I think because Hazard is not available for the game, it's gotta be Vinny. Um, even though he's probably gonna screw just up again. Um, because I don't know what's happening right with Vinny Junior, but he just can't seem to find the back of the net every time. It's been a bit frustrating. He's a very fit fan. Um, uh, on the right side, we've got his counterpart, um, we've got Rodrigo. Um, it's quite cold in here, 16 degrees, oh my god. The air condition is so low right now, honestly. And then extra striker, we've got the one and only Benzema. Um, like, as if I'm not going to play Benzema, I mean, I don't need to talk about that anymore. Um, and, yeah, um, I think for the bench wise, mm, Hazard is not fit, which means, he, which means I think Valverde is going to be on the bench, maybe come on, for maybe Modric or Cruz. Um, I think that is what we're going to do. I think Isco is going to be on the bench again, maybe come on, maybe he can give us a difference, maybe if it's a nil-nil game, which I hope it isn't, I hope we can trash um, Villarreal in the first half or first um, 60 70 minutes and then you know comfortably defend that'll be cool that'll be very good actually and then i think that we are going to put maybe Ooh. who do we put if i was it i would put nacho as like a kind of um backup center back in case ramos get injured touch wood um kind of option. I'm also thinking I just got it up. Um who was what am I thinking about? Um Mariano, yeah. I don't I don't see Lucas B getting that. I just don't. Honestly I don't. Um Mariano I think maybe essential. Um so we have two more choices, and I'm, I'm just gonna go with Lunin and Altuve, and just to keep it safe and fast. Sorry, not safe, fast. Asensio goes in. Gonna go with Lunin and Altuve. Honestly, I think that this is the time where we have to put our best team, and this is why we are. I've pretty much put our best team, um, because um, it is the be best game. It's a. It is the Biggest game, of course. Um, Varane would have uh, get in there had he not been injured. And we all know how good of a defender Varane has been for us in the past, I want to say, past five years at least. He has been so good. Um, I'm taking this as the team. Um, let me now for my predictions. I'm gonna split it into half and I'm gonna um, do one for Real Madrid fan and a neutral fan. We're gonna start with a Real Madrid fan. I would hopefully, hopefully. Um, we can win, and I'm gonna go with. Oh. I'm gonna go with one nil for us. I think we're gonna scrape a sixty-seven minute Benzema goal. I have a feeling. I have the exact number of feeling. I don't know. It's just I have it. I think for the first half it's gonna be pretty boring. It's gonna be end-to-end -end stuff. Second half we're gonna come out in sixty-seven minute. We're gonna score. And then I think Atletico Madrid are going to lead. Um, I'm going to take the lead. Suarez is going to score. And then I'm going to say that Wanda Doni come back and win to one. I think they're going to score a 66 and 66 minute equalizer just at about the same time we score. And I think they're going to score one in the 83rd minute. Um, I'm not so sure who would score, but. I, I know the timing basically. Um, that's what I think as a Real Madrid fan. If I switch over to another side of things, which is um, the football fan. Hello, I'm the football fan. I would go with um, Real Madrid to win 1 0 as well. I think that we are going to win 1 0. But for the athletic game, I think they're going to win 3 1. So it could go either way, it could be Real Madrid winning and then Atletico losing or Atletico winning and Real Madrid winning or both team lose or both team uh, it can be anything basically um but I hope you guys have ended today's video 
hit the like button if you guys did and also hit the like button to give a bit of luck obviously um not give a bit of luck give hit the like button um if you are a madrid fan and also hit the like button if you are atletico madrid fan and if you want atletico madrid to win the title that's make sense there but you know so forget to let me guys on already and i'll see you guys in the next one peace